Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If you chose to use the Select for Deposit window to assign your deposit ticket ID values when creating your company file, then you can use the Select for Deposit screen to combine the amounts of the various customer receipts which you receive through the Receipts window into a single deposit amount with a single deposit ticket ID. This can greatly reduce the stress of reconciling your bank statement with the multiple possible receipt amounts that can be individually posted within Sage 50. To access the Select for Deposit screen, select Tasks from the menu bar, and then choose the Select for Deposit command. Within the Select for Deposit window, use the Account ID drop-down to select the cash account within which you would like to group the amounts that were received through the Receipts window. Next, enter the date of the deposit into the Deposit Ticket Date field, or use the Calendar drop-down to set the date of the deposit. Next, in the Deposit Ticket ID text box, enter your desired deposit ticket ID, which you would like to use for the total amount of the deposit when you are reconciling the selected account in the future. Then simply click the Deposit checkbox that appears at the right end of each line item amount which you received to mark it as being a member of the deposit. The total will display at the bottom of the screen. When you're ready to save the deposit with the selected ID, simply click the Save button in the toolbar at the top of the window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.